Hi, my name is Rob Howard, and I'm the founder of Daily Story. We're an email and SMS marketing automation platform. And today I just want to quickly address what is a double opt-in SMS. So a double opt-in SMS is a type of text message that you're sending to a recipient to confirm their intent to receive SMS marketing from you. So the reason that you want to do this is because if you're using a mechanism such as a web form or a pop-up on your website or a QR code or anything else to collect SMS numbers that you want to send text messages to, um, you want to do what's known as double opt them in. And what you're doing when you double opt in is you're, you're confirming that the message that you're going to send to individuals um, and the number that you're communicating with is the same number that is agreeing to receive those messages. So for example, if I was to text a number and text the keyword join, um, it's pretty easy to understand that, that text coming in with the keyword join is from a number that wants to be opted in. However, if you're using a web form or a pop-up or something else, you can't identify who is sending the message. So the problem exists when Joe takes Ann's number and submits it in the pop-up and now Ann is getting text messages that she didn't want to receive and that causes problems with delivery. So let's look at how this works exactly. So when you run a double opt-in process, what you're gonna do is you're gonna capture the mobile number. So you're gonna capture, like I said, a web form or a pop-up or th through some other mechanism on your website. Um, you're then gonna run through an automation and that's called a double opt-in SMS automation. What's gonna happen is, is that, that, that number comes into your system the automation runs, such as an automation in daily story, and that automation makes a number of determinations. So for example, it's gonna say, have I received a reply to this message? Um, I'm actually gonna send back a, a message to the, the number that came in. I'm gonna say, you know, thanks for signing up. Please reply join to confirm your subscription. And what's gonna happen then is the recipient of that message, if they signed up as intended, they're gonna reply back with join and they're gonna get the expected text message that they wanted to sign up for. However, if they reply with something other than join or if they never reply at all, it will mark that number is opted out because they are not opted in. They have not confirmed their intent to receive SMS marketing. So that's how double opt-in works with SMS marketing. If you're collecting any phone numbers off of your website or off of another system besides directly texted in keywords, you really should consider using double opt-in to make sure you're keeping a good clean list and that you're not gonna put yourself at risk for any carrier violations. If you'd like to learn more about double opt-in SMS, uh, we've got a great blog post we put together about it, and I'll put a link in the comments about it.